Hello there, this is Dave Allen from Max and Questions, and today I'm using Explain Everything to show you a little bit about how to use BlogZ. So here's the BlogZ icon here, and actually it's when we open up the application, this is what we see, and this is where you start putting in your text. Now this here, I've actually put something in already, I've put some text in there and some pictures, and I've probably uh, copied and pasted in the HTML in this here. What you can do with this here is you can do all the stuff you need up this area here to uh, format your fonts and your stuff. And that's quite easy. And then all this down this side here is where you bring things in. If you want to have pictures in there, you can bring it in from your photo roll. You can bring it in from items that you've already brought into uh, your blog already. And you can even bring in YouTube videos and stuff from Picasso or Flickr. So there's a lot of things that you can do there with Blogsy on this section here. And if I go to the next we can do with it, this is where you're bringing in the HTML and you can throw it in there and then you can flick it over and you can see what's on the other side there in full featured WYSIWYG stuff. And on this here you can do your settings and it's quite simple, you just uh, do all your service settings and general settings and whatever else and it's all pretty simple stuff. So let's just show you a feature in ev explain everything now with an arrow. So for instance, there's an arrow showing you how to do things there. And I can move that around the background still. And also I can turn this arrow around and put it over there. So that's just showing a little bit of what I can do with explain everything, which is a nice little app that I have here. And if I want to, what I can do too is I can select to put some text in the screen there and just uh, type in here and just select that when it's done that away and then I can move around the text and put it wherever I want to in my presentation. So this is not about blogs here, this is about using explain everything, doing a bit of two things here. And once you've got stuff in there with explain everything then you can take stuff out as well if you want to too. Let's get rid of our arrows and so on. So that's uh, some fairly handy stuff there with that. Now if you want to bring pictures in there what you have to do is you have to open up these things over on the uh, right hand side here and we've got all these things down here. You tap on wherever the um, thing is that you want to bring in. So you want to bring in an image and maybe you want to bring it in from the photo roll for instance section here. So I've tapped on one of these things here. I've got something in this is the photo roll. And then what I can do is I can just choose something like this here and what I'll do is I'll just drag that and I'll drop it over onto this area here. In fact the one I've brought in already is this one here so I've dragged that and I'll put it in over here. And I can drag stuff and put it so it goes uploaded into the uh, Flickr account if I want to as well. And see that there? Tap on that and then it will upload. So, um, what I've done already is uh, I started a new one here. And on this one here, what I did was I took this image over here. Let's get my pointer again. So I've got this image over here and I dragged it and dropped it in and dropped it right on there. This one was very easy to do because it's stuff that I've already got in uploaded to Mac 20 Questions. And once I've got it like that, then all I need to do is just to uh, quickly drag it across. I don't need to upload it. So there you go, a quick look at uh, some of the things that you can do with uh, Blogsy. And it's um, an attempt by me to use Explain Everything to show you how to do something on the iPad. Perhaps not quite as good as using something like Reflections. If I had an iPad 2 or 3, then I'd be able to uh, do that and record all my video off the iPad. But on this one here, I can't do it. So hopefully when the money gets a little bit better, I will be able to buy myself a better iPad and be able to do some proper how to do things videos in the iPad. So this is Dave Allen for Mac to New Questions. If you're on YouTube there, please click on the like button and don't forget to subscribe to the videos as well so that's when I've got new ones out. You're going to be the first to know about it and you'll get to see the videos before anybody else does. Thank you very much. Bye bye now. Talk to you again soon.